a fuck it. Let's get right into it, because I'm kind of excited to play this. So, no one's here, but I don't give a fuck. I'm still going to say, welcome to the stream, everybody. And, uh, let's play some Pokemon. Because I, I finally have Sword and Shield. Emphasis on the word, and. <laughs> but, I finally have the new Pokemon games, and I'm kind of excited to play them. Because, it looks really fun. So I'm just going to get right into it. We're going to play some Pokemon Shield. For the couple hours I have before I have to go to work. Oh boy! If you don't like it, well, that's, that's your problem. So it's time to play the other game I recently purchased that takes place in the fucking British Isles. Oh boy. Uh. You. Female avatar is adorable, so I have to. Uh... I don't know what to name myself. Came in unprepared. Ooh, ooh, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Yeah. My dude. Registration complete. Oh boy. Oh hey, autosave. Oh hey. Weird text that. Oh fuck, I'm a hungry tuner guy. Yes, hello. Welcome, one and all, to the wonderful world of Pokemon. This looks like a football pitch. Our beloved Gallo region is a wonderful place with thriving nature. Beautiful cities and many Pokemon with which we share our lives. Oh, -ho. as you know, our society is able to thrive because we live in a society. Hello. Thanks to help with these, thanks to help from these mysterious creatures that we call Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon are all around us in the sea, in the skies, and even with us in our towns. Are those pit of, huh? No spoilers, Teach. Those of us who choose to raise and train Pokemon to do battle and compete, we call Pokemon trainers. Yeah. Oh, but I'm getting carried away. Please allow me to introduce myself. My name is Rose. Or is it Rose? It is a pleasure to be here. I'll turn your gaze to the Galar region's greatest Pokemon trainer, your undefeated champion. Time for Champion Leon's Exhibition Match! Uh, that sounds like a you problem, Tank. This fucking dude and his weird ass facial hair. Also, he has a Charizard. Mm. Oh no, he's hot. Exhibition or not, Leon, the pristine record is about to end. I'm gonna beat you here today. You know I don't lose these battles, right, Han? Charizard, Dynamax. Oh shit. Yo, real talk, Gigantamax Charizard looks fucking awesome. And title drop. And then the star of the show, Wulu. <laughs> that was a nice house. Chunkazard. Oh, hi, Munchlax. Look at me playing my Nintendo Switch video game console. Hello, hello! Oh, hi. Oh, 
that your flash flash new phone, my dude. <laughs> I already do, I already like don't regret at all naming my character my dude. We watching Lee's expedition match on it. You can't cheer him on with your hands full. You know the only way to proper cheer on Lee would be with his would be with his famous Charizard pose. Oh dear. Flash new phone. Pop. Didn't expect to see you here today, dear. Isn't this? I like how she's named Mum and not Mom. Yeah, that's exactly why I came running over to get my dude. Never mind watching the match now. I've got it recorded at home, anyways. I'll record all my brother's matches. Boom. They're related. <laughs> Come with me, my dude. You should be here any minute. And Lee always brings presents when he visits, so I wouldn't forget that bag if I were you. Okay. I've got to run. See you at mine later. I would I would try to do the various British accents, but I can't. How you, how you doing, much lax? Oh. I have awoken him. Town map. Road a map, alright. Punish lax PQ, yeah. Alright, fast text, yes, yes. You save him. Gyroscope. All right. Perpetually angry, so you know talky. Yes. Yo, her hair has physics. It's kind of adorable. By kind of adorable, I mean, oh my god. Did a video on that mum used to watch her comedy dramas. The fireplace is bitten to the house. Keeps things warm in the harshest winter. Much like sleeves leftovers around its bed from time to time. Hmm. There are lots of books and magazines about Pokemon neatly lined up. Real talk? I haven't had played play like a full Pokemon game on a home console. <laughs> love it. I love it already, and I haven't even actually started. Stance is kind of awkward. Then again, who am I to judge? If you're looking for your bag, my dude, and you leave it in your room, grab yourself a hat for the weather as well. Hey, mum. Rushing off in that state, my dude. Didn't hop say you should bring your bag. Saw it, last saw it in your room. Don't forget to grab a hat for the weather. It's kind of hot. <laughs> when your mom calls you, my dude. <laughs> Evie plushie. Super soft to the touch. Oh, I want it. Latest video game console is sitting by the te the teddy, the teddy. You know, I s I was doing some image searching for stuff I can use for my stream the over here, and uh, I saw a video called "Why Pokemon Sword and Shield Isn't Set in Britain," and I now think that person is actually stupid. Like, very stupid. Bet you went to buy as a family. It's super comfy. It puts you to sleep instantly. Man, I wish I could do that. Grabbed your mom's old bag. Dude, I don't know, Tank. I just read, like, the title and the thumbnail and then scoffed at him for being stupid. 
Open the X menu by pressing the X button. Ho! Oh, oh, Ho! Imagine that. Save your progress by saying save. Check your location around the next town map. Check this adventure guide anytime you want key item. Okay. Look how fucking adorable. Oh, even the the bag actually like Oh. Oh, don't you look at don't you look a treat. I knew that bag would suit you. Now how are you wrong? Hop is waiting, isn't he? That's the best I can do. But remember, no going into the forest for the two of you. Also, she has a man's voice, just accept it. <laughs> Happy Munchlax. Oh, hey, three potions. Nice. Oh, and a fishing rod. Already. Okay. Waiting for you. I'm ready for some fucking adventure. Okay, despite some of these textures being fairly low res, this is fucking beautiful. Oh, buddy, you. See what we got in the mid? I saw a Butterfree. Oh. Oh, <laughs> look. Have a look at you, my dude. That old bag looks like it could put you over. At least we know it should hold anything Lee might bring, even if it's as big as a Snorlax. Yes. Oh, hi, Wooloo. Wooloo? What if that's... What's it doing there? It's, it's trying its best. It's trying its best. <laughs> you silly, Wooloo. Let's see what you're up to. Don't go using tackle on the fencing. Now, you listen. No going past that fence. No. Everyone knows they're scary Pokemon and living living in the slumbering weld. Weald. <laughs> That's taken care of. How about it, my dude? Let's race. But I can make it to my house first. Well, with you lugging about that big old bag. I love how we roll around. Meh. All the Wulu and the Butterfree. I'm talking to every Wulu. You can't stop me. Welcome to the town of Postwick. A farming town since days of old where people and their Pokemon live in close harmony. Oh, I'm fucking no. Never heard of him, Tank. Power of Science, hey, it's this guy. Power of Science is amazing! They can battle and trade Pokemon with other people, but just by walking around. Isn't that super amazing? Yeah? Pretty cool. Ah, oh, look at this wee young lad. Hey, my dude, Hop was looking for you, you know? But no need to go to the next town to find one. He lives right next door, right? Wait for him. This just makes me want to play all of, like, the major console JRPGs. All of them. Simultaneously. Yeah, it sounds like a, uh, clickbait idiot tank. Mum, is he here? There you are at last, Top. Oh, you brought along my dude. Hello, dear. Yeah, yeah, but where's Lee? Have you got him crammed up in a cupboard? He's still not here yet for the hundredth time. Honestly, Hop, you must learn some patience. Yeah, Hop, fucker. Probably only just arrived at the station at Wedge Wedgehurst. Obviously not, Peter, because, you know, it, it's put to the male rival. Then that's where I'm going. You know Lee's hopeless with directions. 
I'll make sure he doesn't get lost on the way. Oh, will ya? Yes, that probably is for the best. You gotta come with, my dude. Still never met my big bro, right? Can't miss out on your chance to meet the undefeated... Champion. Wait for you out on the route. Go on, we'll hop pick up Leon, won't you, my dude? I know you're the reliable sort. I'll have everything ready for the bab babcue in the garden. By the time you're all back. Oh, hey. A, uh, purloin. No? I can't remember the fucking name of this Pokemon. I'm terrible. Look at all those trophies. Oh, hello. The hop, his brother is a superhero. Mm, yes. Alright, time to raid Hop's room. Leon is so busy that he hardly comes home, but I would like to keep his room clean and tidy. Look at that fat stack of magazines. Collection of various caps. Books and shit. Jesus, a well-used training machine. Pokemon probably can use it too. This must be Leon's room. Yo, those posters, though. Cameron would love that Gengar poster. Posters of the top three most popular Pokemon in Galar. Really? Machamp? Okay. Hey look, it's a Nintendo Switch. Where's the Pikachu, Pika Pika? Tank, you scare me sometimes. I mean, all the time. Let's get a move on! I see a big gathering of people. Only remember, my dude. Wild Pokemon could come out of nowhere if you walk through patches of tall grass. I got my Wooloo with me, so I'm ready for battles against wild Pokemon, of course. But not you, my dude. So we'll steer clear of the tall grass as we go. Okay. I want to go in. No wonder didn't that tall grass tree if you got him. Fuck you. Go meet Lee at the station. It's dead ahead from here. Adventure. Which I think I'm gonna turn this up a little bit. In OBS. Maybe four. Oh, more grass. What did I say about no spoilers? Well, look at look at Mr. Dude here. Moist. Hello, hello, Winchurst. Your champion Leon is back. I promise I'll keep doing my best to deliver the greatest battles for all for you all to watch. I didn't. <laughs> Therefore, I've not played the game nor watched anyone play these games. T. John. <laughs> if it's literally any information, don't say. It. You silly. Our unbeatable champion Leon, you and Charizard are the greatest. Well, thank you for that. <laughs> Look at fucking Hop's face. That cheeky smile. <laughs> hope you all, hope you'll all carry on training up your Pokemon and never shy from battle. Then come challenge me for the champion title. All over Twitter. I don't look at Pokemon things on Twitter. I've been trying to like avoid some spoilers. Some. 
We're on it. We've we'll all been working on our battle skills, just like you've taught us to, Lee. Yes, I'm a special boy. Just because you see it all, doesn't mean I see it all. <laughs> that Charizard here is too strong for the likes of us to take on. Please, too true that Charizard is blazing, blazingly strong. Other Pokemon can be strong as well. That's why I want the strongest of trainers... Strongest of challengers to fill the gym challenge and come battle me. I can't speak, by the way. My wish for Galar's... My wish is for Galar's trainers to work together to become the strongest in all the world. Charizard agrees. How happy Charizard is. We hope. So my number one fan in all the world's come out of his way to pick me up. Look at you, Hop. I reckon you've grown exactly an inch and a quarter since the last time I saw you. Oh, really? Bingo! That's the sort of sharp eye that's kept you undefeated so long, eh, Lee? Because anime, tuner guy. These bright eyes over here. I've got it. You must be my dude in my right. I've heard loads about you from my little brother. I'm the Galar region's greatest ever Pokemon champion, and a massive Charizard fan, too. People call me the unbeatable Leon. Come on, Lee. And you, my dude. But I can beat both of you back home. Bad hop. Always wanted to be the best. Like no one ever was. With proper rival of his own, I bet he'd push himself to become something truly special. Look at all those things on his cape. Brother Ronan, I bet you fed well for today, but don't you fret. I'll always be around to make sure everyone in Galar can have a champion time. Yeah, unbeatable until some fucking kid comes in with her level 50 Pokemon and wipes the floor with them. <clears throat> Come on, Lee, you promised us a present, so out with it. You brought my dude to me Pokemon. You did, didn't you? I know you must have. Alright then. The greatest gift from the greatest champion. It's showtime. Showtime. Take a good look, you two. Oh, it's starter time. Grass type Pokemon, Grookey! Fire type Pokemon, Score Bunny! And the water type Pokemon, Sobble. Oh my god, they're cute. There they go. <laughs> this is the most adorable starter introduction I could have. I, I didn't even. <laughs> <laughs> Aww. Poor Sobble. Alright, line up everyone. I want them all. <laughs> Which will you choose? Yes. They're so fucking cute. Go on, you pick first. I've already got my woo-woo, after all. Okay. Oh my god. Alright, uh... I wanna look at something real quick. Before I ch make the ultimate decision. Okay, I know who I'm going to choose. It's Grookey. Press type Pokemon Grookey, eh? It's soothing, like a nice long walk in the woods. Yes. Press type Pokemon Grookey, is it? Alright, give him a nickname. I know what to name him.
Mail me from Matt Halpern. High five! <laughs> Shut up, Tank. Don't make me feel bad about my decision. So be greedy for you. Nice one. I'll go with... Hey, look. See? Sobble's got a partner. Oh, he's going for the weaker type. That's interesting. That's different. I'm going to be the next champion, so be ready. You and I will be doing some serious training. Also woo. <laughs> That you will be hot. That's why I brought along these Pokemon for you and my dude. The two of you can battle and train and grow stronger fast. Stronger together to try to reach me. Meanwhile, Score Bunny's just like, ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> and you'll come with me. Oh, okay. Charizard will show you the ropes. He's strict, but real strong and real kind, too. No Pokemon left behind. Enough of all this trainer nonsense for one night. Dinner's ready, children. Bring along your Pokemon and let's all eat. Mmm, food. Oh, that's, that's some nice kebabs. God. Yay. The next day. Spent the whole night with that new partner of yours, right, Hop? Maybe. Two getting on all right? Understand one another? Understand? Maybe even built up a bit of love? <laughs> of course I have. My dude's made fast. Friends with her groupie, too. Then listen up, new trainers. Believe in yourself and your Pokemon. If you trust in one another and carry on battling side by side long enough that someday... I even become worthy rivals for me. The unbeatable champion. What are you looking at? What are you looking at her for, Lee? I'm the one who'll be coming to challenge you. Yeah, hop. Or Lee. Or penis. Uh. Think my dude might be able to challenge you? Then I guess she's my first rival. But I'm not playing to lose to her and miss out my chance to beat the unbeatable champion. Just having a Pokemon with you doesn't make you a real trainer, you know. Proper trainers raise their Pokemon up to be first rate in battle, too. Oh, you think you're worthy of calling yourself such a proper trainer already, Hop? <laughs> Guess I'll be the judge of that. Let's see how you handle yourself in a battle against your friend. She's up for it. What do you say? Willing and ready to take Hop on in the first ever Pokemon battle of your life? Yes. Believe in your pocket of Pokemon. Care for them too, with all your heart. Do those two things, and I'm certain you'll learn to choose the moves that suit your Pokemon. Most importantly, to have a champion time battling with them. Gonna have a grand old time. Looks like everyone's on board. Pokemon and trainers are like, let's do this. Just every match that Lee's ever had. Read every book and magazine he left behind at home, too. I know exactly what to do in order to win. It's fine, I can just spam tackle, it's cool. Ruby. Pokemon Battle Disney. I've got two partners with me. Scratch, not tackle, but still. Oh, I scratch you with my steak. Made it to cactus. Yet, I've had another trusty ally to my team. Hmm, how convenient that I learned a grass type move and go against his water type. 40 power, physical, okay. 
Oh, Sobble's faster. Also knows Pound. Goodbye. Do you already know about type advantages? This ain't my first rodeo, kid. Uh, yes, Q. You may. Aha, uh -huh, get fucked. Pokemon through one. You and that group here too much. <laughs> oh, that was a shock. I guess I know why Lee thought he should give you a Pokemon too. You need a Pokemon. All fought hard. Then you almost want to let out Charizard and join in all the fun. Then Charizard just fucking murders us all. Good effort out there, Grookey. Why don't I get you all sorted? I like how the claws are coming out of his ears. <laughs> My dude, you've got real prompts. In fact, I've got a favor to ask you. Be a real rival to Hop, would ya? Push him. Make the both of you stronger. I already want to get stronger and stronger. See me battle now, Lee. So come on, you gotta let me take on the gyms. Ear claws. Ear crab. You join the gym challenge? Think you're ready for the single greatest competition in the Galar region? Not putting the cart before the Rapidash there, little brother. Ha. Pokemon. Reference. Yeah. Adding Pokemon to uh, famous uh, sayings. If that's really what you want to do, you two have a whole lot you need to learn about Pokemon. Especially your friend, my dude. Before you think take, before you think about getting gym badges, uh, best to think about getting a Pokedex. Trainer's Pokedex helps them... Learn lots of things about all the Pokemon out there, including their strengths. But it's more than just a collection of data, you know. It's a record of a trainer's love and passion for Pokemon training. Oh yeah. Right, right, we get it. Pokedex is in, we're on it. Looks like it's off to the Pokemon Research Lab for you and me, my dude. That's the kind of enthusiasm a trainer needs. I'll let the professor know how to I'll let the professor know to expect you. We're gonna be the next champion, so completing a simple Pokedex would be nothing. Just another page in the tale of my legend. The Legend of Hop. Ocarina of Time. I mean, um... Probably better go tell your mom that we're heading out, though. Ah, she'll be fine. Wall JK. Oh, Jesus. Oh, the Wooloo broke down the thing. Dude, did you just hear that just now? Gate's open! The Wooloo that was there. Oh, he done did it. Bop of the Wop. I was tackling defense pretty hard earlier. You don't think it actually broke through there, did you? But it's off limits. No one's supposed to go in there. Remember the professor's granddaughter went in once and she came back in a real state. The state of Alabama. That was nothing compared to the earful she got from the professor afterward. My dude, what do you say? Yeah, we gotta go in there. Right! Even if we're not supposed to, this is the kind of scene where you simply have to do what's needed. Hope you're ready for anything, because we're going in, my dude. Is it Wednesday, my dude? It's Wednesday somewhere. I want to say hi, wants to say hi to Mommy. Alright, fine. Slumber. Come on, my dude. Can't just leave a Pokemon on its own. Pro Controller or Joy-Con? That. That Wooloo, where do you think it got off to? Fog is really coming on thick now. Uh-oh. If we don't find that Pokemon soon, it might be trouble. Hello? Oh! Uh, video games, Peter. That's all. Squirrel! Squovit. Look at them cheeks. Them some fucking cheeks. Yes, this is Lost Woods. Well, if you suck. 
Dude, just beat uh, Lewis Hamilton. Get all diamonds. You'll get, you know, easy 100 mil. Easy. Why is my phone exploding? Responding to a tweet I was tagged in. Oh my god. Sneaky, sneaky. Do, 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 this music though. That's those are some powerful strides right there. Well if I can sneak around in the grass. Bird! Rookadee. Ooh, I need one of those. But I can't catch Pokemon yet. Eat the barb. It looks a lot like a Natu, just different colors. By Halpern, Matt Halpern, aka Drummer of Periphery. I was trying to think of a, like, a really good drummer name, and that's the first one that came to mind. I thought about naming him Anus Pastry, but I don't think the game would allow that. Hear that? Is that Pokemon crying now? You think? I don't know, maybe. Yo, look at that thick ass fog. Yo, look at that squirrel. Dude, I'm gonna catch all the Pokemon. Fuck! This fucking UI is really clean, by the way. Or HUD, whatever. Into the fog. Come on, my dude, the move. Oh, yeah. Into the fog. God, this fog is thick. This is mad. I can't even see my own hand in front of my face. I think I get now why this place is off limits. Uh oh. Dun, dun, dun. Nani? Oh shit. What the? Him. It's Shield Boy. Well, rip in peace, Grookey. That's all I have to say. Hmm. Oh my god, that bass. Hang on, we gotta listen to this. Oh my god, that bass slaps so hard. Okay. This is fine. 
Dude, I can't see anything. You okay? It's fine. Yo, this is really cool. And it's like... It's actually like, uh, do messing with the music as well. Dude. What, Lee? How did you manage to find your way here? Your pants with directions, you always get lost. <laughs> uh, anyways, that's nice to hear from the little brother who had me worried sick. I've been waiting ages for you two and you never showed. Of course I came looking forward to both of you. Where's the Wooloo? We were trying to rescue that Wooloo. Wooloo! Oh, there he is. <laughs> Meh. Little chap, little chap's just fine. So all of you had fainted by the time I found you here. Oh no. You know, this place is out of bounds. But it took courage to come in here all the same. I can understand well enough why you did it. You did good, Hop. At least that Wooloo's alright, yeah? My dude? Thought we'd had it when that weird fog started rolling in and that mad Pokemon attacked. Well, at least it wasn't all for nothing. Attacked by some mad Pokemon? What are you talking about? It seemed loads stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen. It just had this sort of... Presence. The moves didn't even touch it. I mean, really, they seemed to pass right through it. The moves pass right through it? So the fearsome Pokemon they say live in the slumbering world. Actually illusions or something? Hmm. Get strong enough and maybe the two of you could be the ones to reveal the truth someday. Hmm. For now, let's simply get out of this place. You'll be alright now that I'm here with you. Even we did get an earful from Lee. What an experience! Let's make a pretty fine first page in the tale of my legend. Oh dear. Don't forget to tell your mom we're off to watch hers now. She'll go, she'll go spare her if you leave without a word. It's even worse than just leave. You did. Oh my god, I can't fucking read. Oh, there's two buddies now. No, I want to talk to the other one. Okay. I'll talk to the buddies. Mummy. Munchly. Yes, Hop is the rival. Oh no, isn't Grookey just the sweetheart? And yes, I heard the news from young Leon. I'm glad someone bothered to tell me. Off the wedge, Hurst, aren't you? Here we are, a bit of pocket money for your journey. Buy yourself a little something at the Pokemon Center. Maybe some potions or something. Remember that Grookey will battle to the very end for you. So don't you go push the poor dear too hard. Franco, shh, 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 shh. No spoilers. New Grookey. Okay. Look after my little my dude. My little my dude. Come home to rest any time that you need. After all, east or west, home is best. Let's... Okay, again. Yo, mother? Fucking Jesus. I'm about to go horny on main here. Anyways. To adventure! God damn, <laughs> A 
Okay, hop. Here we go. This is quite the big step, you know. My first step towards becoming the next champion. Guess I'll probably train up Sobble a bit by having a battle against Pokemon in the tall grass. You should get yourself to the building with the purple roof and the giant... Or the great red and white ball mark all in front. That's the Pokemon Research Lab. Okay. I actually do think Gen 3 was the... Like, Halloween was the only, uh region where you actually like your father actually showed up I want I got potion oh I see what's happening that wall of Wulu is preventing me from uh, going that way Ooh, what is this little thing over here I want to touch it touch Nick it Looks very mischievous. Wait, I have Pokeballs? Since when did I get some Pokeballs? Dude. This changes everything. No, Peter, you cannot. <laughs> oh my god. Can... Do, do another attack. I want to see you wipe off your tail again. Because that was beautiful. Well, of course there's Ultra Balls, but this is the beginning of the game, so I don't have any. Yeah. First of many. Oh, we're gonna learn Taunt. An attack I'll never use, probably. Take a look at this thing. Oh, it's a dark type. No wonder it looks so mischievous. Jolly nature. Rash nature. What is that? Okay. Oh, special defense is gonna be shit. My dude. Who's your trainer, my dude? Alright, well, since I can catch things, uh, I'm catching all the things. Including you, you little scaredy bitch. Got you, Squabbit. So I'm so glad that they actually, like, made a button map for uh, using a Pokeball. Beats having to go through the menus. I'll probably my Yoshi. Maybe. For a second I'm like, wait, why isn't it showing the Pokedex entries? Oh, that's right, I don't have a Pokedex. Burb, give me the burb. Get over here. Okay, this I might actually use. Because I know what it evolves I know what it evolves into. Unnerve, eh? Oh, okay. And spook. That'll be mine. So yeah, I'm only gonna be like the seven millionth person to use a rookity. Oh, okay.
because I am very not creative. These are going to be some of the greatest nicknames you've ever seen. Paralyzed heals, nice. gone this whole time without catching a Wooloo. What is wrong with me? Bang. How the battle background actually represents where you are. That's uh, that's something new. Oh, I know Franco. All right, I got the Wulu. I want to wake up, the sweet sleeping Wulu, right? They schlarp. They schlep. Oh, hi. <laughs> hi, Charizard. Okay, first things first, let's go to the lab. Hi, Le Le Leon. Squall. Well done, you've reached again. Oh, hi, Charizard. <laughs> Welcome. Well done, you reached the goal and managed to find the Pokemon Research Lab. You did a far sight better than I did my first time. I'm hopeless with directions. See how your world has already grown, all thanks to having Pokemon with you. I know, I'm sure glad I got Charizard with me. Keep me from getting lost all the time. Now, in we go! Dude, can we just talk about the fact that Leon and Charizard are like BFFs? It's fucking, it's, it's kind of adorable. Where I get these emotes, they don't work. Hmm. Forgot to give it to Professor Magnolia. Everything in here looks fascinating. What was that? <gasps> it's a Yamper! Oh my god! It's fucking cute! <laughs> Why are there so goddamn many cute Pokemon? <laughs> what is it today? Dude, Corgis are like the best dog breed. They're so fucking cute. And for info, another never before seen super strong Pokemon. Oh, I wish you stopped these outlandish requests. Oh my god, she's hot. <clears throat> Anyways, I said it before you did. Or anyone else did. It's time for some more. Horny on main. Good to see you too, Yamper. Yamper here is a real champ when it comes to helping you find your way around. He's come to my rescue plenty of times back in the day when I got lost. Oh yeah, that's his trainer, Sonia. What can I say about Sonia? Well, uh, I like the way she cooks. She makes food you can gobble down in a flash. What kind of an introduction is that? Oh, this isn't a professor, damn it. Forget we were rivals during your our gym challenge. This wasn't just Yamper helping you out, I did too. Anyway, nice to meet you. Name's Sonia. I'm the professor's assistant. This is my this is my dude. <laughs> She's a new Pokemon trainer. Set her on the right path, would you? Can, can I just have the Yamper and hold him and hug him and love him forever? Uh, what does he think I am? Always got this head in the clouds. It's no wonder he gets lost all the time. Oh. Looks like you got a Rotom phone. Hey there, Rotom. I like how Rotom is just like... Yeah, I, I, I don't know how to explain it, but it's cool. They use Rotom to power technology now. Rotom phones are handy little things, aren't they? 
We've got a map and a navigation tool. That said, Leon still gets lost, so... Oh, sorry, so tell me, you know a lot about Pokemon? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, well said. In that case, I'll make it so that you can use the Pokedex on your Rotom phone. Oh, nice. It's now, the Pokedex is now a phone app instead of a physical thing. Technology. Just so you know, that Pokedex is a gift from my gran. Did you let gran know that you received the Pokedex? She lives in the house down along Round 2. Oh, okay. That must be, uh, Professor Magnolia. Leon's a right amazing champion. I'm basically just an assistant, and I'm not even Grand's official assistant either. I've just been calling myself one. Somehow it makes me feel a little restless. Hmm. Where's the Emperor? I want to pet the boy. Data? Perhaps it's measuring something? His reading seems to be fluctuating. The whiteboard is positively covered with notes from top to bottom. Also Charizard. Looks, looks like it's a, uh... I'm trying to explain uh, Dynamaxing there. Uh, gigantification of Pokemon. While the general principle holds that Pokemon grow stronger and larger by evolving, it's also true that simply making oneself appear larger is another survival strategy with merit. Interesting. What is the Dynamax phenomenon? This phenomenon which Pokemon take on gigantic forms has only been observed in the Galar region. Moreover, it only seems to occur in specific locations and under set conditions. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, that's awesome, Kayfabe. Also, hi. <laughs> Yamper! So fucking cute! I've never actually listened to Nightwish. I should probably do that at some point. Steve is the ultimate cute, but Yamper's up there. Hey there, trainer. Sorry to stop ya. You just left the lab, right? So that means you've got a Pokedex, eh? I love talking to new trainers and giving them useful stuff. Well, thanks. It's a potion. Use one of your Pokemon's HP. It's low. HP is like a Pokemon stamina. You can even use potions during battle. Knowledge is power! Good idea to talk to lots of different people and read everything you can in your journey. Oh, hell yeah, I am. Hello, Rotom. That feel in po using a Pokemon to uh, uh, gather information about Pokemon. Nothing namely about small body Pokemon taking advantage of the slightest opportunity to soar your larger opponents. It eats berries non stop. Oh, there is Franco. Already talked to him. <laughs> Cunning and cautious. Only survives stealing food from others. At least he tries to swipe it. Ah, I see. That's why his tail is so dirty. Why not, Peter? Its fleece grows too long, Wulu won't be able to move. Cloth made from the wool of this Pokemon is surprisingly strong. Eh. <coughs> Let's find Pokemon. Okay. <coughs> Way more snug, smug than it has any right to be. Yeah. Probably save. So I turned auto save off. Never get lost during your travels, don't forget your trusty town map. All around here is just quiet countryside, but wait until you see a big city. It'll take your breath away. Oh, they released a new trailer for Remind? Oh, fuck. I'm gonna have to watch that when I'm done. That rather grand building beside us is the Pokemon Research Lab, but if it's Professor Magnolia you're seeking, you'll find our home down far in Route 2. Trumpets of Adventure. Oh my God. 
or what the sign here used to say. To the right is the Pokemon Lab. On the opposite side is the station. Okay. Welcome to the town of Wedgehurst. Our quiet borough is home to the esteemed research lab. Got here. Oh, train station. Welcome to the Pokemart. This is what you got. No Pokeballs. Fucking SMH my head. Actually, I don't even have any more Pokeballs. I have one left. Has been delayed to a rail car inspection. I'll just wait. The world you see out the window is that yeah, the world you see out the window of a train. It never stops changing. Isn't it lovely? Yo, can we talk about how hype this fucking music is? Cause it got some bangers here. The Charizard pose. Just doing the pose along with Leon makes you feel like I've gotten stronger. I saw Leon at the station. He's such a powerful presence. Recognize him before he even got close. Ooh. Fangirls. NPCs. Leon's just amazing. He's a superstar to everyone. I used to want to be a professional Pokemon trainer when I grow up. I can't think of Pokemon, about Pokemon day in and day out the way Leon does. And that's why you're a loser, kid. Oh, hi, Hop. Got your Pokedex from Sonya? It's time to meet lots of different Pokemon and start building up a strong team. But battling a strong Pokemon in the wild can leave your team in a bad way. Not to mention what battling another trainer can do. Luckily, we've got the Pokemon Center. <laughs> Luckier yet, they're dead easy to spot. They look the same wherever you go. Come on, my dude. Bet you've never been inside one. Okay. let go. Level with me, my dude. Is this your first time in a Pokemon Center? <laughs> no. I don't think you need me to tell you what you already know. Hey, if you two kids are Pokemon trainers, you might want to buy some potions before you head out. Jeez. I'm already good, though. I need to route two, my dude. Come find me, uh, maybe, when you're done here. Is it true that wild Pokemon... Or it's true that wild Pokemon can be scary, but once they become your allies, there's nothing more reliable. Questions? Oh, okay. Rotom PC. What can I help you with? Again, Rotom is just like now the the like Pokemon that helps everybody out with modern technology. It's kind of cute. I don't really care too much about these, so. Yeah, he's got some big old cheeks. <laughs> I like how Rotom goes to sleep whenever you walk away from him. He's like, hey! Hey! So thankful for Pokemon Centers, they fully heal your Pokemon as many times as you need, and for free. Well, that was awesome. Best healing animation. Okay, and Grookey and the rest of your Pokemon team shall be better now. Alright, do you have Pokeballs? Fuck. Anyone here sell Pokeballs? I, I need balls. Hey, this month's birthday horoscope is spot on. Oh, you want me to tell your fortune too? Alright, sure. What, do you, what nonsense do you have to say? Okay. In that case, can you tell me the month you were born? Oh. Next time you know what day you were born. It's getting weird. Got it! It's your birthday, yes. So you were born on April 27th, your fortune is... Let's see here. Oh, what's that stain here? Oh, it must be from my snack. The page is smudged and I can't really read it. <clears throat> People at your birthday are going to be super duper lucky. 
Might even run into a legendary Pokemon, or maybe not. Anyway, see you later. Wow, it's just like real horoscopes. Incredibly vague. Looking for the Pokemon Professor, you can usually find her at the lovely home by the lake enjoying this slow life. Oh, whoops. Morning, my Pokemon wakes me up, and in the evening, I put him to death bed. Can't imagine my life without Pokemon. I'm gonna get tired of saying Pokemon. <laughs> I'm already tired of saying it. Heard that Leon has a younger brother. I bet he's an amazing trainer, just like Leon. Barry, is I got your fresh pick berries. What do you say? Interested in something? Hmm. Yeah, I'll buy a couple of orange berries. Why not? There we go. Having a meal with your Pokemon makes the food taste extra good. Yes. Must talk to all the Wulu. Eh, get out of my way. Poke it all. Okay. Hello. It's fun to do some shopping in a boutique. You just getting a new hack and change your whole look. You know, each shop offers a different lineup of apparel brands. I think the brands they carry here might be a bit too young looking for me. Welcome to our boutique. Anything you ever find. They have thigh highs. Well, you know what you know what time it is. I'm just uh just not gonna talk about it. When in Japan. Oh, I actually get a different bag. Canvas bag. I hope it's not made by a uh, Bethesda. I'm doing okay. Here. 
Oh, that's cute. Help. Honestly, I like the glasses. Beast Churger. Mm. Little put on zombie bar, go ahead and use fit. Okay. Steve shirt. I can't afford it. Fuck. Steve shirt. Oh, I need the Steve shirt. Oh, God. I need the Steve shirt. I, I, I gotta have the Steve shirt. Oh, my God. Uh, Steve shirt. money can I get out of the shit? Fuck. <laughs> Alright. Steve shirt is the number one priority right now. This is my dude been thinking. If you're a Pokemon trainer now, you must want to try your hand at the gym challenge, right? Okay. Yeah. Gym challenge, mate! Annual competition where trainers can battle it out for the right to challenge a champion. But the trick is that you've got to be endorsed if you want to take part. And Lee doesn't think I'm up to stuff. So, uh, I'm thinking I'm going to talk to the Professor and see if she could help. Okay. You gotta take part two. Proper rival is just the thing every trainer needs to keep growing stronger, after all. It keeps you motivated, right? The professor's house is way at the end of Route 2, so let's head there and give our teams a chance to train up a bit along the way. Fuck. That scared me because that was loud. Thank you, Alex RS, a game, for the sub. Appreciate that. Holy shit. That scared me. Hello. Sonia and Leon used to have a healthy rivalry, but. But. Leon loves Pokemon and loves Pokemon battles. I remember he would always go out, even on practice matches. Not gonna tell me? Okay. Anyways, thank you very much for the sub, dude. In order to bring out the full strength of their Pokemon, trainers must be knowledgeable. <laughs> Wooloo agrees. <coughs> Excuse me. Basis for Pokemon Trainers Lesson 2. Don't forget to record your progress often. Basis for Trainers Lesson 3. If a Pokemon uses a move that matches its type, the move powers increases. Lesson 1. Pokemon at the top of your team will be first to enter battle. The, ch the chillin's got it. See that house in the distance with the purple roof? That's where the Pokemon professor, dude, she's got a nice fucking house. Look at that. Look, look at that. That is a nice house. If you're jumping there, no, that's fine. <clears throat> Alright, give me some trainers to beat up. I need money. Over here, my dude. Alright, my dude, it's time we filled in our teams a bit. Oh, jeez, hi, Leon. I like Hop's reaction. And I'm here to teach you how. You'll need to catch Pokemon if you got any hope of filling in that Pokedex. Lee, where'd you come from? Oh, Lee. Look at you, my little dude. Or little my dude. You already caught some on your own. Your mom gave you those Pokeballs, did she? Huh, I'll give you some more balls in return. I only ask that you catch plenty of Pokemon. Pokemon around here seem easy to catch. Almost like they're itching to join some trainer's team, wouldn't you say? Twenty, hell yes. Gotta go cry. Oh no. Oh no. 
I'm not ready, but I am absolutely ready to watch it. Pokemon your team will get XP when you catch Pokemon too. And of course, they get XP from battle. So take on other trainers you meet along the path to help your Pokemon thrive. Your team will keep changing and growing as you get stronger together, no doubt. Even I don't know exactly how yet. Show your champion something good, I. Okay. All right, I'm gonna catch a loser Pokemon. The professor will be shocked when she sees. Yeah. Hello. Oh, hello. Blip bug. Okay. This is the weirdest looking bug I've seen. Is it its eyes? Those are its eyes, isn't it? Those are its eyes. Holy fuck, those are some large eyes. I have bug. No, 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 no. Bug capture. Bug mine. I wrote him. Off the found garden, this Pokemon has hairs on its body he uses to assess its surroundings. Interesting. I might keep some of these around just to see, like, their evolutions or something. Oh. I didn't even see him there. Also, the Pokemon actually showing up in, uh, in, in the wild instead of it just being completely random. Power trip. Ah, I see. See him with his cheeks? Four. that Warrenberry. That was quick. Stab it. Gee, how much power does... Oops, that's not what I wanted. 35, okay. Okay. One more peck. That's all we need. That's what we got. Okay, the dude gained more XP from actually battling. Mm -hmm. Please. What is this over here? Choodle. That is a large head. Not oh, the water type. Okay, I think it's time to switch. its eyebrow like curls when it does an angry face. Speed. 
so it's water type, snapping turtle. Starts off battles by attacking its rock hard horn, but as soon as opponent flinches, I still don't ever get let's go. There's a lot of Pokemon here in these first couple routes that are exactly a foot tall. I've noticed. Oh. Hello? She did, and then she walked away. She's just like, hey, hey, hey whatever. Trainers, finally. Money. I need money for that fucking Steve shirt. Hello. Common manners for Pokemon trainers battle when their eyes meet. Peace. Bit to go. Oh, you want to have a cheeky Pokemon, Baito? That sweater is actually pretty cool. Gangster Jake. I was gonna say, if he didn't have a Squavit, despite wearing a Squavit uh, sweater, I'd be very disappointed. Well, I didn't know that first part, but I've, I've seen, you know, John West tell me race. Poke. Yeah. Whenever there's a strong trainer, I always look right at them. Cool. If you don't want to battle, it's important to make sure you aren't seen by other people when you're walking around. Ugh. I don't even have it near enough for the Steve shirt. I think it's, what, 30,000? Hello. You have no idea. GG. If you don't think I'm gonna spend all my money on just a Steve shirt, that's you're sorely mistaken. Say. Trainer tips. Pokemon can gain experience points by battling other Pokemon. Experience points can help you grow stronger. And your Pokemon will still get experience points even if you catch a Pokemon you are battling against. Yay! Oh. Two potions. Cool. Hop. Ah, damn it. Oh, 
Come on. Go yourself. Alright, fine. I'll bite I'll fight this thing instead. Epic. Pressing the plus button, not freaking X. I'm stupid. Let's grab this. Ooh, more Pokeballs. Sweet. Ooh, another trainer. Sweet. I require money. Cute and strong together in combination. Yeah, sure, okay. Talking about me, lass? You're talking about me, lassie. will do this on his own. Gosh damn it. It's fine. It's fine. Do 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 do. <laughs> Are we cute and nothing more? Looks like our strength is still has ways to go. Mm. So disappointing. Pokemon have types. Fire is strong against grass. Grass is strong against water. Water is strong against fire. Remember that and you'll get really strong. Mm, yes. The double unnerve. How unnerving this battle is. Yep, I gotta work tonight. So, I only have like another half hour to uh, play here, or stream here. Oh, well, this is uh. I don't think this is gonna go well for me. It's a Pokemon ability. 
every Pokemon has a ability, and Rookie D's is unnerved. Everyone levels up. You get a level up, you get a level up. Oh, pfft. Just ran straight into it. Do, do, do. Yeah, fuck it, let's go. And burb. I dare you. How dare. I need more money. I need a nugget. Couldn't beat Hops one, but I'm gonna beat you. Oh, no. You think so, Ben? <laughs> I like how the trainer disappears during the uh, struggle bug animation. He's just gone. Lose to wild Pokemon, lose to many trainers. Eh. 420. Pokemon hiding in the tall grass or trainers waiting along the route. Which one you choose is up to you. Yes. Oh boy, it's time to meet the prof. Look, there's a Professor! Oh, there she is. So have you unraveled all the secrets of the Dynamax phenomenon yet? Oh goodness, no. The whole thing is still full of questions. I would hope my granddaughter would take over my research, but... Dear me, I'm sorry. I didn't even notice my guests. Where'd you go, old woman? My name is Magnolia. Welcome, young trainers. Now come, let's head indoors. Cute old woman. My hop, dear. I see Wulu has made some new friends. You must be my dude. <laughs> my dude. <laughs> I trust you received the Pokedex from Sonya. I'm sure you'll have it complete in no time. Must already know about Dynamaxing, right? My dude. Professor Magnolia has been doing some... Oh, oh, that's the wrong voice. Professor Magnolia has been doing some research into the Dynamax phenomenon for years and years. And it takes a proper understanding of the thing... If you plan to use Dynamaxing to the fullest. There you go again, Leon. Always talking about Pokemon. There are other things that are worth knowing about too, you know. Like how many different types of tea there are. I like this professor. Hey, professor, do us a favor, would you? Let me convince Lee he should endorse us for the gym challenge. Oh, Leon. Why wouldn't you endorse them? Hop and my dude only just started out as trainers. 
still loads they don't know yet. Oh dearie, I thought your dream was to have everyone in the Gator region become strong trainers, isn't that right? Well, yeah, you're not wrong. That goal's precisely the reason why I gave them both Pokemon, in fact. <laughs> Fucking hop. So come on, come on, no whammies. Right then, in that case, how about this? See if the two of you can show me such a brilliant battle that I'm left with no choice but to endorse you. That was Leon, not the professor, goddammit. Don't worry. Make sure both your teams are in good shape before the battle starts. Right, I'll be waiting outside, my dude. Metal, now to remember, be sure to give it everything you've got. It's the best thing you can do for your Pokemon, and for yourself, too. Peaceful. Oh, hey. I like how all the Pokemon have, like, pet beds. Do what plants would want instead of what you want. Keep that in mind, plants will grow. Yes. Oh, that's a lot of books. Oh, whoops. A lot of the books that look difficult to understand. It's own collection of Magnolia's research. Hair drying a barrel hairbrush that has been left lying around without being put away. This must be what's her face's room. Headphones, got a tablet, probably powered by a Rotom. Because that seems to be the way the Pokemon universe is going. Everything you can need for the latest and trendy makeup looks. Cool. I, I see it. I, I see that sticker, that Yamper sticker. Oh, jeez. Hi, camera. How you doing? Ooh, TM57. Okay. Found a TM. Sign him over here, too. It's glowing. Oh, great ball. Hell yeah. Oh, 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 hello. Battle of Freshwater, okay. I saw that glowy glow. Are you up, my dude? Gotta battle me so I can get myself an endorsement. Fine. I'm gonna become the greatest trainer there is. And to do that, I need to get that, I need that endorsement to take part in the challenge. Combat me with everything you have so we can prove to Lee that we've got what it takes. I'm fine, I'm late. Okay, never mind. Burbs in the lead. That's what I wanted. Of course. I'm rather, I'm rather interested in seeing how you two young trainers battle too. Listen, you two. The reason I'm unbeatable is because I learn from every battle I see or take part in. That's how I've gotten to where I am today. Show me something good in this battle. Show me your moves! It's time for my legend to begin. You keep saying that. Oh, he's got a third now. I don't know what his third is. Got a bit stronger. Me and my team will put you to the test and see. Okay. I love how Lulu just rolls. So cut. Eh. 
thought about just going the easy route and switching to a uh, Grookey, but nah. I've never watched those either of those shows. Yeah, you. Is there a true power? Oh no. In Christ, right? Water gun. Save my best for last. Oh, he's got he's got his own rookie D. Okay, be a close one. That's exactly my sword man. Herb. Oh, it's only level five. I got this. Hope you've watched carefully, Leon. The secret to success is spam peck for fuck. I'm gonna say spam peck forever, but uh, then I gone. That happened. Damn you, Hop! Excuse me, gut that loss. I expect nothing less from my rival. I need more money. I need the Steve shirt. Even got my Pokeball throw perfect, too. Sing of defeat and the joy of victory. Guess going through both is the key to the two of us getting stronger, right? Yeah. Oh, hello. My dude, Hop! Well, I've seen a match like that one. I suppose I have little choice but to give you both an endorsement as champion. Oh, shit. Okay, we got the letter. We just got a letter. We just got a letter. Anyways. Yes, thanks, Lee. I swear I'm gonna win my way through the gym challenge to reach you. you may both be young still, and plenty of rough around the edges, but it was a proper battle. Charizard and I were both feeling the excitement in every less cell of our bodies. Hey, Lantis, how's it going? Poppy, have always tended to get caught up in things like how you throw your Pokeball out, things that have nothing to do with real strength. Honestly, I've been worried. you still obsessing over that sort of nonsense, but it seems you've really grown a lot, little brother. Little brother. I'd like to see some more thrilling Pokemon battles out of you, too, my dude. Right, my dude, you and me are gonna train up against one another to aim for that champion's title. Oh, hell yeah. The more we keep battling against one another, the more our Pokemon will grow. What's that? What's that? Oh, well? Oh, what the fuck? Yellow. My dude, would you look at this? They're wishing stars. Wishing stars, really? Okay. Can I sell it for money? Don't found the Galar region with mysterious power. Said your dreams come true if you find one. Oh, one of these my Pokemon can Dynamax. They're gonna be a massive yes. Trust you to pull something like this. They say wishing stars fall down for those who have a true wish in their heart. You know. I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever. There, said it three times, so surely my wish will come true, right? Don't be silly, Hop. These wishing stars are composed of a curious sort of rock containing unknown power. They're one of the most precious resources we have here in the Galar region. 
But they won't do a thing for you in that state. Give them to me now and I'll have you sorted. Right, right, you've done heaps of research on the Dynamax phenomenon, haven't you, Professor? Please. Give my dude and me the power to Dynamax. First we got a battle against that mad Pokemon in the slumbering world, and now this really feels like we're getting caught up in an adventure of a lifetime. Three weeks. Awesome. I do understand your excitement, younger man, but don't get carried away. I want to save your energy for tomorrow's journey. Yeah, sure, fine. Oh, hi, Sonya. Seems I came back home right in time for all the excitement. Hey, you lot. Wanna have some dinner? You must be hungry, right? I've been totally obsessed with making the latest trendy curries. Tom's fucking excited. You want some curry? Healing. Oh, look at her. Run her finger around her hair. Whatever. It's morning at last. And time for our adventure to finally start. Ah, uh, good morning to you, young challenges. Oh, is it true you've really met some Pokemon you didn't recognize? Is there anything more you can tell me about it? Uh, well, uh... There's this weird heavy fog. This even weirder Pokemon appeared. My dude tried to fight it off, but then I think we both passed out or something. It's all pretty hazy. Ah, uh, right amount of information you are. The right fount of information. Excuse me. I can read. My dude, hop. These are for you. Ace. Ooh, Dynamax Band. The star has been fixed to it. It's a light that allows Pokemon to Dynamax when at a power spot. Ooh. These are your Dynamax bands. I made them by fitting the wishing stars you found last night into those bands. Wow, thanks, Professor. This is brilliant. It's just like the one Lee has on him, too. Now we can Dynamax our Pokemon like he does. Holy shit. My word, you don't waste any time, do you? I think you'll find that it's not so simple as all that. There are a number of conditions you must meet if you hope to have your Pokemon Dynamax. Take on that gigantic form. Oh, don't be afraid to go to all sorts of places and meet all sorts of Pokemon. That'll help fill out your Pokedex, too. The Legend of My Reign is about to finally begin. The Legend of Hop. Come on, my dude. I'll beat you to the station. Okay. Don't be afraid. Okay. Strange Pokemon in the slumbering wild. Hmm. I don't know. I've got an uneasy feeling. For some reason, I can't fucking speak. <laughs> How much money do I have? Still not enough. Fucking triggered. Last thing before we race, my dude. See, I've got some great advice for you. What? You know how you sometimes see Pokemon wandering about all of the tall grass here? You move real slow like and crash down. Those Pokemon won't pay you any notice. But on the other hand, if you whistle at them, you'll be sure to catch their attention. A bit rubbish at whistling. Just remember, if you need a fail-proof trick? Press the left stick. Okay, try it out and see if you can catch most Pokemon, my dude. Remember Wedgehurst Station, right? Where we went to pick up Lee before? That would be the goal, so see you there. Okay. Oh god, here they all come. Oh god. Okay, they stopped carrying. <laughs> I like how the shootles are slow, because turtle. Alright, so... Very large head, yes. Let's 
also love how his eyebrow fucking whoops. When he does his angry face. <laughs> All right, okay. I'm making my way downtown. Oh, hi, Amper. What are you doing here? Oh, this is a wild Yamper. Oh, jeez. What's the Yamper doing out here? He's so cute. This is not going well. I need to poke him a little harder. Leaf. Hell yes. Ooh, oh, ta-da. I thought it was poof for some reason. Okay, oh, yeah, he's... He's pupy. Also, again, exactly one foot. A lot of these are exactly one foot tall. Gluttonous Pokemon only assists people with their work because it wants treats as it runs and cracks. Best nickname. He's so cute. Excuse me, she's so cute. All right, what moves does she know? Pokemon's not holding it. I only fetch the Pokeball for, for oh. It's actually nice. Twenty power. Okay. Wait, is this guaranteed paralysis? Oh shit. Mm 
<laughs> oh, there's just a, uh... Okay. I wonder how much money I can make off of that. All right, fine. Icon, like all of them, anyways, connect to other players. First thing to do is stand to arrive at Icon while you're out on your adventure. Means other trainers around looking for someone to connect with. Use Icon, connect with people close by. Press plus button, connect to the internet to be able to connect with people around the world. <laughs> Stamp shed silhouette of Pokemon on you. Be able to team up with your fellow player. Okay. Cool, I guess. Come on, my dude! Never beat me station at that pace. Fine. Do da da do dee do do da da healing up. Doing Rotom. Oh, yeah, what's him? Damn it! No, I want to sell. Only a thousand. Damn it! I want that Steve shirt. Need the Steve shirt. What's up? It's out with it, my dude. How many did you catch? Caught a really special one. You got yourself. Oh, just one? It's like Ryder Draw. Though we are rivals at all, so that's fair. Swift. Good, good move. Skill machine. A TM might. A TM like that, you teach Pokemon a new move in a flash. You can use them again and again. That one could teach the move Swift. Lee gave it to me ages ago, so now it's yours. Jim Channel will begin and Moto Stoke. Moto Stoke. Moto Stoke. Our train's waiting, so let's go. Hopping into it. Ha. Ha. Lamal. Yeah, I'm teaching Swift, because Swift is pretty good for. Like, really good, actually, at this point in the game. Not funny. Do that laugh. Guess the Steve shirt will have to wait. Not quite so fast, you two. Uh oh. Mummy? Mummy! What are you doing here, Mum? This day was coming since the most you chose Sobble as your partner, darling. Yo, why is our character's mother so fucking, like... Hashtag horny on me. Professor Magnolia was kind enough to let us know that you two were setting out. But here, I'll ask a little gift to see you well set on your way. All the kit you'll need for camping. Camp gear! Oh yeah. No matter what happens out there, if you and your partner are together, I know you'll be fine. Thanks, Mom. Just think how lucky you are. Mother to the first ever pair of champion brothers. <laughs> Cause I'm certain to be the champion next, you'll see. Ah, of course you will, darling. Anyway, do have fun and take care of yourselves. You'll be welcome back here anytime. 
Wish us luck. I don't know that we will need it. There are loads of brilliant trainers and all kinds of Pokemon out there waiting for us. Excitement's running ahead of me even faster than that train can go, my dude. Come on, let's go. We're off. Ah, lots. Ah. Right. Oh, train scene. <laughs> Du, du, du. This look is surrounded by a vast wild area. It's a real sight. There's all sorts of wild Pokemon just wandering about everywhere you look. Plus, you can camp out and do a spot of fishing. I don't think I have a very good time to guide the boat. Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Station Master, isn't this a wild area? What are we stopped here for? Ah, yes, this is a wild area station. Make no mistake. Sorry to tell you that the train is halted due to a flock of Wooloo on the tracks. God damn it, Wooloo. So to be sorry about, this is brilliant! The wild area is massive! There are loads of Pokemon to battle here. You get it, don't you, my dude? This is the best possible place to put together the greatest team. Welcome to Station Square. Dan, dan, dan. I saw that Wooloo. Did you see that Wooloo rolling in the background? <laughs> hey, you and Eevee and a, uh, I knew it. You've had a Let's Go experience with Eevee, haven't you? <gasps> How did you know? We have another Let's Go experience with this Eevee, too. Free Eevee. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Again, one foot exactly. Shit. Well, since it's the, uh, since it's... I'm getting this because of Let's Go. I gotta name the Eevee what I named it in Let's Go. There we go. <laughs> Eevee, I gave you special, you know? You should definitely Dynamax it. Yes. Hey, you a Pikachu and, uh, oh, no, I think I was mistaken. Actually, I didn't. You know, I could actually get the uh, free Pikachu as well. Seems like my children are going some... Giving something to people who've had a Let's Go experience. But what in the world is a Let's Go experience? Hmm, flunkies. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, boy. Fuck it. I'm I'm using I'm using this. All right. I already have four Pokemon <laughs> in my team. Oh dear. Oh yeah, I got an updated cry in uh, Let's Go. Also, Swine Up. Run into stronger wild Pokemon the farther you go into the wild area. If you feel like you're in a pinch during a battle, just use a Poke Doll. I see. No matter how strong a Pokemon is, you'll be able to catch it eventually, as long as you join the gym challenge and gather the gym badges. Cool. way through the wild area to reach Monostoki next. Da da da! Oh. That's a fucking nose. Hi there, would you like to rest your Pokemon? Oh yeah, sure. Happy and healthy. Honestly, as adorable as Yamper is, I don't really want to use it. To be honest. Look at that. 
Ooh, another shot of the wild area. That's Motostoke by the way off that way. That's a big ass city. Between there and here are countless new Pokemon waiting to be met. Oh, hello, if it isn't Sonya. My grand gave me a proper earful in her own way. <laughs> Those two young trainers setting out on a journey, but what are you doing with your life? Ouch. Ah, uh, never you mind that. Nothing to worry yourselves over. Oh, yeah, that hair to whirl. Besides, I've been quite curious about that Pokemon you two met in the forest. I'm thinking I should look into it, so the time works out fine. If I discover something really huge, then maybe even Gran will admit I've got some talent. Yikes, being a doll's got his own challenges, eh? Don't I fucking know. Said you needn't worry about it. I'm glad to be on the road. Really, it's been ages. It'd be great fun to fish and camp and rough it outside again. Oh, I'm off to go stick my head in as many of these red glowing dens as I can find. I'm gonna battle the snot out of a bunch of Dynamax Pokemon and fill another page of the tale of my legend. He was fucking cool. What cheek! What a, what a cheeky bugger. Dynamax Pokemon are really on a le another level, you know? Or Dynamax your partner Pokemon too if you want to take out an opponent, take on opponents that strong. You'll find spots here and there in the wild area that emit a red beam of light. If you think you're up to it? Check them out. There'll be Dynamax Pokemon lurking inside. So with that, how about I send you off with a little treat for me? Ooh! Box Link. Use Pokemon Box Link. Access Pokemon Boxes while you're on the road to be able to find Pokemon. Hey! Box Link. Be able to put Pokemon from your team into your boxes or take Pokemon from your boxes to add them to your team. Nice, right? Yes. So go wild catching as many Pokemon as you like. Fill in some more of your Pokedex. Wild area is waiting for you. This is the start of your real adventure. No real talk, I'm kind of excited to explore the wild area. I have to. In your Pokemon can you and your Pokemon can play together and even eat together, growing closer to the experience. Pokemon grow very close to you, they may even try extra hard for you during battle. Play well, using Joy-Con too. If you slide your Joy-Con off your system, go wave one, throw a ball for your Pokemon to tree. Ba -da -ba -da. This setup came in a lot area. Be able to play with up to three other trainers at the time. Bye. Bye. Oh, here come Garuki. Oh, look at you. His smile. Oh, here he come. <laughs> ah, this is fucking cool. Oh, here they come. Um. Playing fetch with my poker man. Help. This is, this is too precious. Let's chat. Tell me more. Seems a bit bored. How's it going? Worry about the surroundings. Oh my god. Hey. Eevee. Okay. Yes, you. Vai? Come on, do it, do it. 
This is too wholesome for my dark soul. <laughs> Casually walks towards the toy. Oh, he doesn't care. Damn it. Oh, there he goes. The fact that he puts it on top of his head is just... <laughs> could spend fucking days with this. Oh, they actually earned some XP from that. Okay. Interesting. Fuck, dude. <laughs> and people hate this game. Imagine not like... Oh, hi, Onyx. A little jaw honey. First Pokemon I see in the wild area is a goddamn giant rock snake. Found a note. Someone drop it here. Large Pokemon you see wandering around the wild area is strong. Try battling one. Seems like you're over in your head. Run like the wind. Yeah, Herder National Dex. That's why people hate the game. Also because the textures aren't as fucking beautiful. The tree textures aren't as beautiful and shiny as Breath of the Wild. It's like, okay, I get it, the textures are a little bit low quality, but I honestly, I don't give a fuck. It's still beautiful. Very strong Wild Onyx. Oh yeah, that's level 26. Okay, uh, mm, uh. I'm gonna go for it. Mistakes were made. Okay, uh, let's see. Okay, Eevee knows run away, so, uh, run away. <laughs> now I have to work. In fact, I should probably actually end the stream, like, 15 minutes ago. Okay, note to self, don't try that again. <laughs> I'm enjoying myself too much. Oh, that's the wrong person to talk to. I'm gonna talk to this bitch. Alright, anyways, yeah, I should probably stop here, but god damn it. Welp, I'm already loving this, and I'm still, like, in the beginning of the game. <laughs> I've played for two hours, I've gone through the prologue, and... Ah, uh, also, I, I need to remember that I need the Steve shirt, but... That is, uh, that's all the time I have for now, unfortunately. I wish I could play this for this longer, but unfortunately I cannot, so. I'm gonna have to call it a stream here, and uh, bid you all adieu. So, uh, that, let's see if there's anybody I can raid. Uh, oh, there we go. My boy Keeney's streaming, so I'm gonna go ahead and raid him. So, uh, with that, I will see you guys in the next stream. Later. <laughs>